Welcome everybody to the Weirder College Sports Network. Jesse Gonzalez alongside your color commentator, Eric Dutra. Eric, what we got today? Man, it's a hot day outside. The folks are trying to keep it hot, going 2-0. Let's get it going. 22, ready to come out, and the ball is up, and we are underway. The kick is actually pretty short. Ball is muffed up. It is coming off the chest of one of the Weirder College poets. Already in the red zone. So you see Miguel hand off to Ratana. Ratana end zone in there for a touchdown. And just like that, the Poets put six on the board. Kicking unit number 49, Brock Aldi. First one again. This one looks up and it is good. We have a shotgun formation for Miguel Avina. He's ready to hike the ball. Low snap. He has a connection right there. He's going to come up in the pocket. Deep throw. Got him. Jacob on the other side to make the catch. Touchdown, Poets. What a dime by Miguel Avina. Oh, in red zone territory. Gomez pops up, quick pass. Number two touchdown. is in there for a touchdown. 15 minutes added to the board. Second quarter is underway. There's a floating pass, easily made and an easy catch for number 15, tight end Eric Glotzmitz. 15 was his longest, so give him that the longest. Another handoff to Ratana. Looks like he's just going to blast beast. up the middle towards the right side. And another touchdown for the Poets. So Irwin up the middle into the end zone for a Poet touchdown. Well, thank you for joining us for the first half. We'll pause Shirley here for the second. And stats coming underway. We'll be back. And Joshua we have, Shields oh, on his Jesus. feet, hanging towards the pylon, extends, and he is in for a touchdown. There goes a deep ball. Got him. Play. Oh, what a catch. Into the end zone. Was, uh, moving down the field. Oh, yeah. Like I said, you always want to go north-south, not east-west. Oh, hello, here comes the ball. There's a ball Maybe. down the field. Caught, connected again, Poets score. Connolly with a dime. The freshman showing he got game. Well, nevertheless, the Poets are gonna come up with the victory and they finally push their record to 2-0. Oh boy, I can't tell you how long this team has waited for a successful start to their season. What a great win for the Poets. 2-0 as they defeat Lewis Clark Valley College, 47 to 12. Two and a